Welcome back, family. Welcome back. Now, look, before we get started, I want to give a big shout out to everybody that's been hitting me on the cash app, especially uh, Shantae. I don't know if she want her last name out there, so I ain't going to say it. But yeah, she blessed your boy on the cash app. I thank y'all and I appreciate y'all for that. You know, I was busy, but we're going to get back to these videos and keep it rolling. Now, let's get into this. A young Dolph autopsy was released, right? And it said he was hit over 22 times. They count uh, entrance wounds and exit wounds too, right? But this the places they say he got hit. The forehead, the temple, the face, right back, center back, left back, right arm left arm left chest left abdomen right chin right neck right wrist and right shoulder the police said now check this out right check this out cuz i ain't gonna lie I need the footage from the inside of that cookie shop. Like, I ain't gonna, it ain't even the inside and the outside. Look, I feel like this, right? I can understand at first you holding because y'all still investigate this, that, and the third. But no, we deserve to see the footage from the outside. We deserve to see the footage from the inside. Because I, this can't really tell, this can't really tell me nothing. Now, it might look suspicious to a lot of people because some people might say, well, his back was turned at first, so that's how he caught them first shot. But then when he turned around and when he caught the rest, and then when he was laying on the ground, they kept shooting him like, bro, I had to see the I had I had to see the foot I had to see the footage, bro. I have to like, like it's just it's just one of them things where it only leads to more questions. Like this don't help nothing. This don't this don't tell us nothing. It's like okay, y'all knew he got shot, but y'all ain't know where he got shot. So now we about to let y'all know where he got shot. Okay, I feel y'all on that. That's cool. But at the same time, bro, at the end of the day, we need them videos. Yeah, 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 yeah. We need the videos because some ain't right. Like I said, is that all this going to do is lead to more speculation, more rumors, more fake stories, more fake videos. You know what I'm saying? That's all this is going to do. This ain't help nothing. Like, this ain't say nothing. Like, I'm not understanding this, bro. But um, we definitely need them tapes. They going to have to put that out, man. I'm sorry. Like, they done dropped the ball so much during the investigation. I'm pretty sure releasing the videos now, it wouldn't really help. But it's like we had to literally look at steals and put this and that together. And who ran to the car and who ran back from the car and who was, if anybody, would everybody say it was somebody standing next to them? And then you got to think the 22 times, but everybody saying like, why ain't nobody else get hit but they was aiming directly at him then they was talking about the og bane wayne dude or whatever his name is the one that uh supposedly took the change from big moochie or whatever and then they were saying that he was there and he got shot in the car but see this is what i'm saying see ain't no proof of that and they supposed to have had this man locked up since the uh they did that 300 round round up like back in December or whatever. So it's like, I'm pretty sure if they felt like he had something to do with it, like he probably would have been charged now. But then I can't even say that because they plastered Devin Burns face all across the, the net. Like he had something to do with it. And then they went and got and they got him in like less than 20. Like what? A, a weekend? What? <laughs> they got him. They got him in no time. Still ain't said nothing else about him and anything he got to do with Dolph. So, like I said, man, until we get, like, some video footage or something, all we could do is go with what we have now. But it seems like 
they did a whole lot of stuff just to end up leading us back to nowhere. Because if you look at it how I'm looking at it, the only two suspects is still Cornelius and Straight Drop. They, ain't, they got Devin Burns and they ain't said nothing else about him. They can't find CEO TZ. They let Shondell, they let Shondell go. Oh, boy. Man, if that don't sound like a case that you just dropped the ball on and let fall apart, I don't know what does. Memphis Police Shaw get a buzz for that. That's crazy to me, man. So, yeah, but this said, man, but um, it's just amazing how they let off so many rounds and only Dolph was hit. Especially because it's like, if you look at that shot, like, it don't look like it's a lot of room from, like, the counter to, like, the front door. Now, that's one thing I noticed, too. Like, it don't look like a lot of room. So, it's like, yeah, they could have been aiming everything at him. But what did Raven say? Raven said Bucks was hitting pipes. It was flooded with water, water bursting everywhere. And you know what I'm saying? Like, all type of stuff. What I'm saying is, y'all got that footage, man. We need that footage. Dock it up. Edit it. If, it, if, it, if y'all feel like it's too violent... Edited enough so we could see it. What Ukraine and Russia going to war? Y'all putting out footage from that. Y'all showing people getting hit up from that. So why you can't? You know what I'm saying? Show this dope footage. Cause we need real answers, bro. It's time to stop with all the speculation and guessing. Up. We need real answers. And like I said, with the Memphis PD dropping the ball, and the other people just coming up with theories to make up whatever they want to. We left and we stuck in the middle of nowhere. But y'all get in the comment box, man. Let me know what y'all think about the situation. It's your boy Buddha. I'm out.